I'm Rainy. Welcome to the Fitbit of the Week. This week we're talking about foot pain. So I want to go over um, three different things that you can do for foot and ankle mobility. So we're not only going to cover the foot in this one, we're also going to co cover the ankle a little bit too. Um, only because your foot pain, um, or maybe you do have a little ankle pain, can be caused from many different things. So the first thing maybe that you should do would be to check with one of our doctors and see um, what might be causing the pain, whether you know you might be a runner and you have plantar fasciitis, which is uh, tightness through the bottom of your foot, or you know maybe you just do have limited mobility in your ankle and it's causing pain in different areas, or maybe you just need your foot adjusted, which can be done also. So um, let's start here with the first thing. So we're gonna use a lacrosse ball. If you don't have a lacrosse ball, you can also use a tennis ball. Um, but what we're gonna do with this is kind of like a massage. So what we're gonna do is loosen up the muscles and the tendons um, because they're very tight, especially with plantar fasciitis. So what you're gonna do is just set the ball down on the floor and then kind of step on it. So if you need to hang on to something, um, stand next to a wall or whatever, but you're gonna just gonna roll it across putting some of your weight down, you're rolling it across your arch where it's gonna maybe hurt a little bit because it's very tight. Um, if standing is putting too much pressure and it is hurting a lot, what you can do is get down so that you're sitting um, and then do the same thing so that you're just not putting all of your weight down on it at once. It'll just kind of uh, be a little easier on the, on the muscles. Also, now if you are having limited mobility in your ankle, it can be caused from tightness through the calf, um, or if you have um, issues like with your um, Achilles tendon when you run too, this is a good one to do. So what you're gonna do is put the ball um, right below your calf muscle. You're gonna have to lift yourself up a little bit so that it will roll all the way across the muscle. Um, and then you're just gonna kinda go side to side, get all the way through there so that it can release the tension. Maybe you have a knot or just some kind of adhe adhesion there that you just need to release, um, just like that, All right? And then obviously you would do it on the other foot as, or foot and ink, or calf as well. So the next thing um, is ABCs. So this is more for ankle mobility. So what I'm gonna do is sit here in the chair for this one. You're just gonna sit down and then for whichever foot or ankle may be super tight, Basically, you're just drawing your ABCs with your foot. So start with the A, then move to the B, then move to the C, D, all the way through. So basically what's happening is you're having to move that ankle in so many different direction, random directions that you're gonna strengthen those um, ligaments, tendons, everything around the ankle, but also, um, get some increased mobility in there as well. So you're moving it around as much as you can. All right, the last thing here is a little more difficult. Um, this is called short, a short foot exercise. So this um, is gonna strengthen your arches. So right through the middle of your foot. And I drew a picture here only because it's a little more complicated to show. So what's happening is you're gonna stand on one foot again, stand close to something if you feel like you might fall over. You're gonna press your toes and your heels down, or your toes and your heel down at the same time. So that is causing a raise in the arch. So as these two are going down, your arch is raising up and you're strengthening all those tendons through there um, and the middle. And you're gonna feel kind of a pull as you do that. Um, like I said, it is a little more complicated, so it'll take a little practice to get used to that one. Um, but yeah, so as you can tell, like all of these, Pretty simple to do, you know, you can do them at home, you can do them sitting at your desk if your feet tend to hurt at work, you know, if you're standing, um, standing too much or whatever it may be. So they're pretty simple to do, so you can do them just about anywhere. Um, but yeah, that's been this week's Fitbit, and we'll see you next time. To submit a question, watch a past episode, or to find out more about the Springfield Wellness Center, check us out on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel, or find us on Instagram, or check out our show website at wellnesslab.tv.